What's up everybody, this is the Fandy 21 back once again. And what you're looking at here today is a 38 inch antique brass Homestead Whisper Fan 3. This is a variable speed fan, electrically reversible. It uses a General Electric motor. The fan here dates to possibly sometime around 1980, 1981, or possibly even as late as 1982. It is one of the earliest homesteads that were available available for market direct as a competition to Casablanca. Um, back in the early days, like in this era right here, they he actually used a mounting system very similar, almost actually almost identical to Casablanca, with a slide-up bell canopy and a very similar bolt-through mounting system. Um, this one here, unfortunately, I got this fan from Craigslist around four years ago, and the lady didn't have any of its original mounting bits. She actually included a white generic canopy with the fan, so, but so but nothing else. So the system you see on the fan is a ball and socket system and it is off of a Sears Lasco or Sanyo fan of some sort. The ball and socket the balls I think the balls the ball socket itself I believe is genuine homestead though. Either that I'm not too sure it might be even Casablanca. I don't know. But, nothing really much else to say about it, so we'll give this thing a demonstration. Starting up here on low speed on the downdraft mode. The blades are like a... Some sort of golden oak finish, I would guess. And they're non-reversible. They're the same finish for either side. And these are solid wood blades, too. Well, it's been from 1980 or... Pretty much damn near unwarped, completely unwarped. Uh, they're probably ever so slight, slightly warped, if ever, if any, which is always good. Fan uses a cardboard box Rio stack control for its variable speed, so of course it buzzes. Turn it up a little bit. Buzzing sound you hear is probably something in the motor housing loose. Possibly even the sideband. This fan also had a, a genuine homestead light. At least the fitter was a genuine homestead. I'm not I can't remember if it would have included a globe or not. I don't think it did. But this did have a genuine homestead light on it. I was just too lazy to put it back on the fan for demonstration. Turn it up a bit more. This is around the fan's medium speed here. Take it up a bit more. And here's full speed. Man, we're probably doing around 190, possibly 200 RPM. On well, the fan's full speed, the blade pitch is around 12, 13 degrees. So it's a pretty decent little air mover, especially with six blades. Variable speed has an off control position as well. And we're going to start it back up on the 
low speed up in the updraft position. Take it back to its around its medium speed. <clears throat> and back to the high speed. Yeah, despite the buzzing issue, the fan actually runs pretty quietly. There's actually no bearing noise at all, so. Seems like the fan has had a relatively easy life despite its mounting system <clears throat> getting separated from it. And high speed, we're probably doing around the same RPM, the way it looks. And we'll go out on the coast. Yeah, the Whisper Fan 3, like I said, did, probably entered, was introduced around 1980. And um, I would say they probably lasted to around 1984, I guess. But don't quote me on that. I want to say they lasted until 1984, that's, or 19, even as late as 1985, before Homestead actually started giving up on actual stack motor fans like this and actually outsourcing to Firebird for their fans. This was actually a part of a whole series of Whisper Fan fans. Each each variation was completely different. The one and the two were four blade 52 inch models. The three here was the six blade 38 inch model. And the Whisper Fan four was a 52 inch six blade model, which looked identical to this. And it actually wasn't introduced until later on. This is actually, the 4 wasn't even around yet when this fan was made. So, a little bit of information for you. And that's about it for this video. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video on this 38-inch Antique Brass Homestead Whisper Fan 3. So, see you next time, everybody. And we'll take care.